This is Twit. We've got an email. So uh, this one comes from Chuck. Uh, Chuck writes, what do you think of this decision by Google, which... Uh, We'll tell you about in just a second. Even Pixel Zealots must see that this is a very bad move. Google desperately needs Pixel customers, but instead pushes them away. Regards, Chuck. So Chuck is referring to the news that broke out today that the Pixel stand was the only wireless charger that the new Pixel 3 phones could charge at 10 watts and that all third-party chargers can only charge at 5 watts which cuts that in half. Uh, the Pixel stand utilizes Qi charging, which is an open standard, but Google told Ron Amadio at Ars Technica that the Qi charging is capped at five watts on other devices. The Pixel stand supports the five watt Qi standard and Google's own proprietary 10 watt wireless charging tech separately. Uh, Google says that certification process is underway via MADE, which is the same certification process that was used for the watch bands that um, were introduced back when Android Wear was still Android Wear. Uh, made for Google program to allow third-party chargers to achieve these 10 watt speeds. So there will be like approved approved by Google chargers coming out. Uh, this should happen soon, but in the meantime, Pixel stand, the $80 Pixel stand is alone in this high speed charging capacity. Belkin has the boost up charger in the works that will support the 10 watt standard. So you can have that to look forward to and that'll run $60. So wireless charging will be pretty pricey for the Pixel 3. And if uh, you just wanna quickly come over my shoulder, I could show you the Pixel stand that is very proprietary. And is it, um, is it, is it worth $80? You know, I don't know that it is because it, nope. this is supposed to essentially, it turns it into a little assistant so you can go, I'm going to trigger, just warning. Hey. Let's see, and then that pops up and <clears throat> stop listening to me. And um, <laughs> when, ah, sorry, I have too many assistants at my desk. And when that happens, so when this little assistant icon is on here, this basically functions as like, a home hub, but for your phone. So the pixel turns into like that speaker. And then you can play music from it and command it to do all the things that you would a Google home speaker, but it's through your phone and it's also getting charged very rapidly as it says at the bottom. Um, and it is very rapid charging, but I just, again, I don't know if it's $80 worth. It's a lot more money to tack on to an already hefty bill. Yeah, that was my, that was my yeah, big thing about it. After you, Nicole. Yeah, but. But if you're if you're going to buy a wireless charging stand anyways, like the one that would be relative to that, I guess would I think I'm reviewing I'm getting a review unit of ones that's like 70, it's like 60 or 70 dollars, like high quality, beautiful Qi wireless charging stands, even at five watt are running at least 50 bucks now. So yeah, it's true. Is it like is, is it like 30 dollars worth to have that? I'm. I, I'm a, I'm a, I'm I might say, yeah, it, I'm that a, is I'm the a, cost of a Google Home Mini, <laughs> right? 30 bucks? Oh, yeah. Well, a Google Home Mini on sale, I should say. Yeah. Um, but, oh, by the way, you can, uh, this blacks out at night. So as you can see, there's a little like setting over here. So I can just go into, oh, uh, now you know my path is fine. Uh, <laughs> you guys knew it already. Um, <laughs> that one you guys, that one you guys knew. Um, I pretty much just put that on to, anyway. Let's stop talking about my security. You can, you can change it after the show. <laughs> yes. It's fine. Yeah. So there's an the option to put the screen off when dark. Do not disturb while it's docked so nobody will bug me. Uh, you can set it as a photo frame as you like. Oh, and the other thing is it can be a sunrise alarm. So it'll start to light up uh, yellow, orange, red, and then wake you up, kind of blasting you with color in the face. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Do, do you like that? Well, that yeah, because like, now it's your... dark at like seven in the morning when I'm waking up, it's still kind of dark. And so now I kind of have a little like blast to the face, like wake up, vitamin D from this OLED screen. <laughs>